you know that the Whippet has the highest number of sports-related world records of any dog breed? Interested in learning how fast a Whippet can run and why they're able to achieve such high speeds? Are you curious to know why Whippets are called the poor man's greyhound? If questions like these intrigue you, stick around. In today's episode, we're counting down 10 quick facts about the Whippet dog. And that all starts right now on The Smart Canine, the only show that explores the most interesting stories and facts behind dogs. But before we dive in, hit that subscribe button and notification bell for more interesting dog facts. And hit that like button for more incredible Whippet content. Number 10. Whippets are one of the fastest dog breeds in the world. We felt like it was necessary to mention this fact first. As you'll see in the rest of the video, Whippets are some of the best athletes in the canine kingdom. And as a result, they've set some of the most impressive world records for dogs. So just how fast are Whippets? On average, Whippets can reach an astounding 35 miles per hour. It's possible for some whippets to hit a top speed of 40 miles per hour, but only when running in full stride. This makes this breed one of the fastest in the world. Number 9. The fastest individual dog in America, and probably the world, is a whippet. Greyhounds may be the fastest breed in the world, but a whippet named Rias is the fastest individual dog. In December of 2021, the three year old male whippet ran the 100 yard dash, finishing with an incredible time of 5.769 seconds. For reference, a mixed dog set the record for the time of 6.485 seconds in 2020. Riaz was so fast that he beat the previous year's champion by more than half a second. Hugh St. Bolt, also known as the fastest man alive, has a personal best record of 9.56 seconds for the 100-meter dash. I think it's safe to say Riaz would embarrass Hugh St. Bolt any day. Number 8. One Whippet is the greatest frisbee catcher of all time Yet another impressive record was set by a Whippet named Davey. Since Davey set the Guinea's world record for longest flying disc catch in 2012, no dog has even come close to touching it. The dog achieved the record in Canada and was able to catch a frisbee thrown 134 yards, or roughly 402 feet. What's even more impressive is that he reached top speed of 40 miles per hour to do so. With such incredible speed, it only took Davey about 10 and a half seconds to make the catch. Davey has become sort of a superstar in the canine community. In fact, Davey even has his own children's book called The Davey Rule, where the Frisbee champion covers important topics regarding kindness, curiosity, and acceptance of others. Number 7. There's a reason why they were nicknamed the Poor Man's Greyhound. If you didn't already know, Whippets were called the Poor Man's Greyhound. Now, this is no jab at the Whippet. If you understand the Whippet's history, then this nickname makes a lot of sense. You see, in the early 20th century, dog racing was a huge sport in England, and the main racing dog breed of choice was none other than the Greyhound. But the problem is that the greyhound racing was primarily something for the wealthy. Even so, the poor working class of the textile industry wanted to participate, and they did so by creating their own racetracks. The men would clear out empty locks, back alleys, or empty fields to use as tracks. They didn't have fancy oval tracks. And because greyhounds were generally more expensive to breed, the working class used whippets as their racing dogs instead. Real soon, the men realized that whippets were just as fast as greyhounds. Number 6. A Whippet is the Fastest Balloon Popper in the World Can you believe canine balloon popping is a thing in the Guinness World Records? We couldn't either. But sure enough, it exists. 100 balloons would be lined up in a 10 by 10 square, and the dog would crush each and every balloon as quickly as possible. Now, you may remember a viral video of a Jack Russell Terrier named Twinkie popping 100 balloons in roughly 39 seconds. However, just two years later, a Whippet named Toby destroyed the previous record. Toby popped all 100 balloons in just 28.22 seconds. That's more than 10 seconds faster than Twinkie. According to the owner, a lot of preparation and training was involved. She would never cheer for Toby by name because he would just come back to her. The owner also practices with blue and yellow balloons, as it's theorized that those colors are the easiest for dogs to see. So, do you think your Whippet is up for this challenge? Number 5. Whippets aren't really big barkers. If you're like me and can't stand the constant barking of some dogs, then you're in luck with a Whippet. Whippets are some of the quietest dog breeds you can find. It's why they make such amazing apartment dogs, as long as you give them enough exercise. According to Newsweek, they're one of the quietest small dogs you can find. However, that's not to say that Whippets don't bark at all. They certainly do, but they're much more of a watchdog, thanks to their hunting instincts. Before arriving in America, Whippets were sight hounds that hunted for their sight and speed. They needed to be extra quiet so as not to scare off any potential game. So if your Whippet starts barking out of nowhere, you better go check it out. These dogs don't really cry wolf for no reason. Number 4. There are a lot of theories on how the Whippet got its name. Like many dog breeds, the Whippet's name has remained a mystery, although with plenty of theories and speculation. According to one etymologist, the true origin of the name comes from the word via. 
for those that understand Latin, it's the Latin word for road. As such, it's become the root of many words such as convey, trivial, vibrate, and of course, whip. Whip has been associated with all things that tend to move quick and fast. Given the nimbleness and speed of the whippet, it sure makes a lot of sense, but that's not the only theory. The Oxford Dictionary suggests that the word came partly from an obsolete early 17th century word that translates to move briskly. However, the word whippet did exist before the 17th century. According to the Oxford Dictionary, whippet used to mean a lively young woman or a light wench. But for some reason, the meaning of the word changed throughout the centuries. Number 3. Whippets are able to smell when a diabetes attack is about to happen in a person. Yes, whippets are technically sight towns that hunt primarily with sight. However, did you know they have an amazing sense of smell too? A 13-year-old whippet named Holly had been trained to alert her owner when she's about to have a diabetes attack. Believe it or not, this whippet can actually use her sense of smell to detect a significant drop in blood sugar levels. When that happens, the chemical makeup of the human's breath changes. It's subtle, but a highly trained dog can pick it up. Whenever Holly's owner begins to show signs of a dangerously low blood sugar level, Holly gets in her face to let her know something is wrong. Most of the time, Holly alerts her before any symptoms even show up, giving her time to prepare. According to the owner, Holly has woken her up many times and has probably saved her life countless times too. Number 2. There's an athletic whippet that's been nicknamed the Michael Jordan of Dogs. A whippet named Spitfire has been appropriately nicknamed the Michael Jordan of Dogs by ESPN. It's not just because he can jump extremely far. Rather, it's that he can do it all, making him arguably the most athletic individual dog in the world. He was the first dog to jump 31 feet off a dock, which was an untouchable world record at the time. However, Spitfire also holds the record for speed retrieving, in which the dog jumps off a dock into a pool of water, swims to the other side, and retrieves an object. Spitfire crushed this event by being the first dog ever under 4 seconds. And let's not forget what took Michael Jordan to the next level. The insane vertical jump of Spitfire is also world record. In fact, Spitfire has a remarkable 8-foot vertical. So, is there a dog as impressive as this whippet? Number 1. The only reason why whippets can reach such high speeds is because of the shape of the dog. Now that we've been reminded several times just how fast and athletic these dogs are, the next question is, how? How is it that whippets are able to run so fast and jump so high? Well, it's all in the body. According to the AKC breed standard, the whippet has a gentle arch on its back. When these dogs are running in full stride, they're in a double suspension gallop. In other words, these dogs are always in a concave or convex movement or running hard. They either have their legs fully extended or curled up beneath the body. Whippets need to be in a slightly arched shape to move like this. Dogs with a rigid spine simply don't have the flexibility to run hard. So, what was your favorite whippet fact? Did we miss any that deserves to be on this list? Let's know in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed this video, consider subscribing to The Smart Canine for the most interesting stories and facts behind dogs.